Hi everybody, it is Cindy with Chopwood Creations. Um, it's been a while since I've did a video. Um, been 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 very busy with life and my wine business and my Mary Kay, but um, I have finished a journal that I absolutely love. It's a gift for Kendall, who um, is my recruiter at from Wine Shop at Home, um, and it's it's something that's very dear to me. Um, this is the cover. Um, it's got a napkin. The napkin was a gift from um, Denise. It's a Paris themed napkin. Um, I use papers out of here from um, Medieval Missive. And then um, there's some papers in here, I believe, from Crafty Cat. So let's take a look at the journal. This is the cover. Um, very simple. There's a pocket here, and I just realized I forgot to put in um, a tag. I apologize if you can hear my dogs. My husband's on his way home from a fire. Um, the spine, I have added a little uh, cute, I don't even know what you want to call it, but it's got all kinds of little tassels and, and doodads on it. I have done this in a traveler style notebook. And since I use this gorgeous um, Indian lace, I believe it's what it's called from Gypsy gypsy oh my goodness i knew i'd forget the name um i will link her below she has some beautiful sari silk and laces and yarns but i will i will link her below okay so that was bothering me um it's victorian gypsy girl uh, she has an epsi shop but this is this is one of the laces i recently purchased from her it's absolutely gorgeous so that's the the end and then I'll show you um, I added some beads and some tassels on the bottom of it oh here's the back cover back cover is plain and simple um, the sorry silk I have for the tie closure is from the Victorian gypsy girl and then you go ahead and open it and the front pocket is just some journaling cards note cards Oh, and I did stamp them on the back. And these cards are from Medieval Mirage. And I have several different sets of hers. So these are just some ones that had some really um, pretty flowers on them. And as you notice, spilling your glass of wine is the adult equivalent of letting go of a balloon and I truly believe this and this is her, a wine journal um, I've created this for her and um, eventually I will have these in in my Epsi shop that is not opened yet um, but if you see this and you're interested in one of these just uh, give me a comment and we can talk but inside it's got the date the name or kind of wine the producer where it was imported from vintage region vineyard purchased at, received from, thoughts about the wine, sight, which is your color or clarity, smell, your nose or your bouquet, um, taste, assisted acidity, or your, the body of the wine, comparison, so what other wines did you try that were similar to this, price, overall rating, date consumed, occasion, shared with family, food, and friends, and comments and memories of this wine. So it's, it's a wine journal, but it's also a memory journal. And in here, you can put a picture of the bottle of wine or a picture of the day or, you know, the label of the wine. And, I mean, this is this is all the same. Um, there's no difference in there. And then there's also a back one that's the same. And then in the center of it, I put this junk journal. Um, this is from, I believe it is Shabby Debbie Do. And I will link it below. Um, it's one of her junk journal kits beautiful papers um, this is a avocado dyed coffee filter from Denise from Wonder Bar Craft she does an amazing job on her avocado dyeing um, and just a little tuck with a couple um, tags in there and then this is an avocado dyed envelope that I've, I've kind of cut the center so she can use it as a pocket um, a book page that I cut in half and put a couple labels in or tags in not labels um, I left this fairly blank so she can you know journal in it as she wants and see there's the um, 
Traveler's Notebook part of it. This comes out as do the wine journals. Um, I have a belly band here with an altered paper clip. And on that paper clip is an envelope with a little note card inside it. And this was from um, Medieval Mirage. This is one of her kits. The note card and the piece of paper on the altered paper clip. Let me see if I can get this back on there. There we go. <clears throat> the other half of the envelope, uh, belly band. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, with some more little journaling cards that she can use. And, and that's about it. The back, back of it has um, a pocket with a couple journaling cards. I don't know if you all can see this, but I circled it as I was doing this. I may have been drinking a glass of wine and I'm like wine stain and I had to circle it because that is truly a red wine stain on this yellow paper. So this is for Kendall and I hope she really enjoys it. Uh, my next project, I will be showing, um, doing a tutorial on how I created this journal cover. I've had uh, several requests for it. So until next time, I hope everyone's having a great day. My husband's over here making fun of me, so he just walked in my office and he's being a brat. Blessings.